Plus, Michelle Taylor and Rick Deadweiler stop by to share their thoughts on the project and what viewers can expect. This is an episode you do not want to miss. Be there, Monday, November 7th at 10 a.m., right here on DETV. Good morning, Wilmington. What's going on? I'm your main man, Big Ivy, talking to town, Mr. Positivity, Mr. DETV. And I'm here with my lovely, lovely co-host, Vincenza. And good morning, Wilmington. And good morning, Ivan. Good morning, Vincenza. How are you? I'm wonderful. I bet you are. Why I, do you I, got this I, glow? This I woke up this morning so excited because I knew today was going to be probably a, an episode of Good Morning Wilmington no, that's going to go in the books in history as one of the best ones yet. First of I all, Vincenza I walk, I, I walk in, Vincenza has this glow going on about her. And then I'm like, Ben, <laughs> what's happening? She's like, just be positive, you know? And, 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 and that's Vin. So I'm super excited about um, today's show. Um, but before we get into that, how was your weekend? It was wonderful. I had the opportunity to spend time with the family, which everyone knows. I spend my Sundays with family. Mm -hmm. But I worked at the bistro as well, mm -hmm. cheering on our Phillies. But you, you got to say you got to say that with a little bit more enthusiasm. I wish I wish it, the outcome was different. However, we should still be very proud yeah, yeah. of our uh, our lovely Phillies and also the Philadelphia Union. Most definitely, they both you know both Most teams definitely. made us proud. So I just really appreciated that they energized the city right. and inspired so many. Really, that's what it was all about. So yeah. we'll take it and we'll I'll, run I'll with take that. it. And speaking of energizing the city and being proud of something in the city. We are here today with United Way Impact, Impact 365 that I'm super excited about. So that's today's episode. Oh, yes. Bam. Big, big. And we have a live studio yeah. audience. Do you hear that? Look at the studio audience. I think, I, <laughs> yo, come on, give it up. Like, yeah. United Way Impact 365. And we have Tierra Fair, who's on the other side of the room. Tierra, how are you? I am so, 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 so excited to be here today. I, you know, I didn't realize how nerve wracking it would be to actually have a live studio audience <laughs> today, either. but um, I cannot say thank you enough for to everybody for being here. I can't say thank you enough to DETV. This is going to be a really great show and I can't wait for Impact 365 to launch at 6 p.m. tonight. Now, now, Tierra, 30 seconds. Tell everyone that's watching at home or on their cell phones or their tablets, what is Impact 365? Impact 365 is a television show that is for the books. It is all about collaboration, convening, and the community. It is all about United Way's mission, but more importantly, United Way's collaboration and impact in the community. And our impact is not one day or two days, but Impact 365. So that's what it's called. I think that's amazing. Wow. I, wow. I really do. Well, Tierra, we'll be right back with you. So don't go anywhere. So thank you so much for being here. Wow. I can think of 1.9 billion reasons why I'm so excited today. Does it rhyme with ball? Powerball. <laughs> so I was I woke up again this morning feeling super thrilled to arrive on set because I knew it was going to be one for the books. Mm -hmm. But I also thought, huh, no, no, are no, you no, feeling no. lucky? No, everyone? no, you thought you were <laughs> gonna be called out today because you thought you was gonna win Powerball. That's what that was. I get it. I get if it. I didn't show up today, you know where I am. Right, right. I would never do that. I would never do that. But you know what? I have a question for you, Ivan. All right, go ahead, shoot. If you have maybe, you know, won the Powerball, mm -hmm. what would you do with all that money? Uh, First thing I would do, I give I give some money to charity. Um, no. Tierra's over there, like me, me, me. United Way of <laughs> Delaware. I give look, I give some money to United Way of Delaware, mm -hmm. right? Yes. Because I think they're going. I think I really believe that you know, since we've been in the media here, real heavy, we just watch. You know, you watch people, and United Way has right. been doing some amazing things. They the have programs that they have, the Stand by Me program, um, Impact Three Sixty Five, and yes. other programs. For more information, go to their website. See that plug there? I Boom. love that. Love, love that. Um, but I would um, donate money. I would continue doing what I'm doing, but on, probably on a more a, a scale of teaching it. Mm. Um, I love what I do. So, and, and, and I, I don't know, I'll just put cheese on my Whopper. That's about <laughs> it. What would you and do? I think that's a great answer. <laughs> Quite honestly, same thing. Mm 
Definitely. I'm a firm believer in always giving back to the community because the community will give back right back to you. And right. it's all about supporting others and giving back and paying it forward. So yeah. yes, in honor of United Way of Delaware, most definitely United Way of Delaware, but also other organizations that I feel near and dear to me. You know I'm a huge advocate for promoting literacy, mm -hmm. so promoting reading throughout the state, but also maybe helping the restaurant a little bit since okay. we've been yes. through it a little bit. But, yeah. you know, just giving back, I think, is the healthiest way to, I guess you would say, navigate. Right. I guess money like that. It's, That's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. It is. It is. So, so I'll let you know next week once I hit. All right. Well, well if Ivan's Ivan not here, we'll know. All right. <laughs> All right. We'll be right back after this message, and then we'll get started with Impact 365, mm -hmm. United Way here on the Plaza. <laughs> DETV has been Delaware's premium provider of creative digital and broadcasting solutions that bridges communities and connects people. We create great stories for all audiences. We deliver independent news throughout Delaware. We are digital platform innovators. And we develop marketing and sales solutions so you can stay connected to your audience. Now, why do we do what we do here on DETV? We do it because we care. So. Keep watching and follow us on all of our social media platforms. Remember, DETV, online, on air, on time. Every issue that you care about. Every issue that I care about. And every issue that affects our daily lives is impacted by one simple action. A, a vote. vote. As the Delaware Voting Rights Coalition, we stand ready to protect and expand access to voting. Because our communities deserve a democracy that works for all of us. Learn more and join us at aclu-de.org forward slash dvrc. Government doesn't make a move without an agenda, some type of plan. The problem is we haven't been on the agenda. Sometimes we're overlooked. Sometimes our interests aren't the interests of those in power. I'm your host, Kerwin Gaines, on DETV's new show, The Agenda. We're going to do our best to ensure that you, Delawareans, are knowledgeable about what's going on in the assembly, federal government, local government, it doesn't matter. We're gonna do our best to ensure that folks that make the agenda on a daily basis have to answer for it. Let them explain what they're doing. If it affects you, it's on the agenda. Welcome back. Now look, first up on the plaza this morning are two amazing people mm -hmm. from the nonprofit area in the field here in, Del in Delaware. Um, let me introduce to you the mm -hmm. president, CEO, Michelle Taylor of United Way and the board chair, Rick Detweiler. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. We're excited. Oh gosh, you're excited. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so <laughs> let me start with you, Michelle. Impact 365, mm. what does that mean to you? Wow. First of all, I think it's historic for us. Rick and I were talking about this under his leadership. He really wanted to amplify the work we're doing mm -hmm. from a communication perspective. And while we have the Feel Good Friday, that is intentional about telling stories that will inspire people. The world is filled with so much bad news sometimes, right? But there's so much good work that's being done. We want to bring these stories to life. We want to put a face on the work. We want to make it real to people. And we hopefully that this will inspire people to want to be able to be a part of the change, but also to have hope. Mm -hmm. To have hope. That is one of the most important things right now is to have hope. A, a person or a city without hope is, right. is destined for doom. And, and that's what United Way is giving people right now mm -hmm. is hope. Um, the other projects, the programs that you have right now are, are Stand By Me and, and what else? Because I want everyone to know what's going uh, on. A whole bunch of the programs. So, First of all, I don't want to give it away too much because okay. we want them to watch okay. Impact okay. 365 right. Right. Okay. over the next okay. few weeks. Okay. But the highlights, right, it'll talk about things we're doing around the Delaware Racial Justice Collaborative, uh -huh. things we're doing in education, things we're doing with Stand By Me and the mm -hmm. financial empowerment, things we're doing in the Hispanic and Latino community. Lots of things. Did you see how smooth she <laughs> said that? <laughs> <laughs> we did all that. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Uh, Rick, all right. Talk to me about th Impact 365. You know, uh, and, and Michelle alluded to it early in her comments. You know, we talked about all of the great work that the United Way does mm -hmm. every day, right. not during the summer, 
only, not during the winter months when folks are struggling only, mm -hmm. but 365 days a year. So when we talked about that impact and the idea that folks need to understand what we do, they know that the United Way is here. They know that in a way that we've been making a difference, but let's make sure that we, that we highlight mm -hmm. and, and, and really show the work that we're doing here. If a tree falls in the forest mm -hmm. and no one's there to hear it, right. does it fall? Now, while we're not really concerned about trees falling in the forest, mm -hmm. we want to make sure that folks understand and know about all the great work that the United Way, United Way has, under, has underway. There we go. Wow, yeah. wow. So I do have a question. So how did this series begin? Hmm. Right, great question, great question. So one of the things that we were talking about was a different ways to get, again, our message out in the community, right? Mm -hmm. So it's not just about um, information, it's really about how do we inspire. Mm -hmm. And so we were talking to Ivan, actually. He had this idea this about a crazy, yeah, crazy <laughs> idea of how we could work with him on DETV. And, you know, the thing I thought about was, you know, when you think about the fall series, whatever your favorite TV show is, you mm -hmm. can't wait till it comes back this fall. Right. Like, I'm so mad they cut. Um, NCIS New Orleans, like, why would they do that? Why? So, you know, we were saying, well, what if we created something in a way that people look forward to see, watching it yeah. and that people will look forward to hearing it season after season after season. Mm -hmm. And if it should get cut for any reason, mm -hmm. they will be mad. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Yeah. It was, it was, it was when we, I was talking to Michelle about it mm -hmm. they, and that's how I started everything. I have this crazy idea. And Michelle was definitely, okay, she never said no. I don't really believe she ever said no to me. And, and once we, you know, they came up with the idea, it was reaching the community and how can we, one, impact the community right. and their takeaways. What do you both want? Or what do United Way, what do they want um, the people to take away after the first couple of the first episode? Wow. I want them hungry for the second. There you go. I want them hungry for the second. But I also want people to take away, and I know Tierra said this, we don't do anything alone. So this story, mm -hmm. the way that we also structured Impact 365 mm -hmm. isn't just about, it's not about United Way. United Way is about community. Right. right. So we really also wanted to, to amplify the, the beauty of partnerships, the beauty right. of collaboration, the beauty of collective. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, and we always say that it takes a village mm -hmm. and coming together to really make an impact. Impact 365 makes sense. Right. Please, Rick. And, yeah. and something else we wanted to highlight is, is the people. So we talk about, we know the great and the large organizations that are in our mm -hmm. communities making a difference, mm -hmm. but there's also lots of great people that are at the grassroots level mm -hmm. making a difference every day. Uh, uh, and I hate to start shouting names out. Shout them. Yes. About, Shout you know, Daryl Chambers, we know him best as Wolfie. As Wolfie, He's working right. and doing things grassroots in the community that we wouldn't even understand right. every day right. to make a difference. We have Bernice Edwards mm -hmm. down in the southern part of our state, down in Sussex, who again is touching a group and communities that Again, if we didn't talk about her work specifically and the, and, and the work of First State Action Community, we wouldn't know what's going on down there. So yeah. making sure that those folks, their stories are being told yeah. and that uh, we're again, highlighting the people that are making that impact. When you look at, when you look at nonprofit, well, for me, myself, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm fairly new in the nonprofit um, mm -hmm. sector and DETV is a nonprofit. And you look at nonprofit and one of the words that I kept hearing was, uh, it's social impact, right? Social mm -hmm. impact, social impact. and the question is, what are, you, what, is your, what are your organizations do? What do organizations do that can change the world? Mm -hmm. Now, when you look at Impact 365 and you look like, and I was there for every one of these tapings, I, you see the families that are affected by Impact mm -hmm. 365. How does, like, you, you have a Hispanic family, you have a black family, and, it's, and, and, and people that need help, it doesn't care, it's colorblind, mm -hmm. right? Everyone needs help. And that's what Impact 365 is doing. It's putting an umbrella, it's putting, it's putting, it's helping people around Delaware and giving that social impact. Was that what she was looking for? Right, and, and to your point, and Rick was alluding to it, it's the people, but it's also to be able to put a diversity of people. And I know we're on mm -hmm. Good Morning Wilmington, but this is statewide, it's statewide right? right? And it, it's meant to be able to show the impact we're having in all three counties with all of our partners. Mm -hmm. Ultimately, how do we help to more Delawareans um, by having a greater impact, but really by helping them to realize their full potential and realizing what can happen when we work together. Yeah. Yes, mm -hmm. I, I, I now we have a, your audience have a bunch of board members in here, right? Where are the board members at? There you go. Okay, bunch of board members and uh, and also other partners that are here too. Now, mm -hmm. by a show of hands, did 
what are you? No, I'm not even gonna do that. I'm not, I'm not gonna ask that question yet. I'm jumping. I'm, I'm so excited. I'm jumping. I'm jumping the gun right here. Okay, Rick. Um, when you when you saw the episodes, what did you think? You know, first thing I thought about was being inspired, mm -hmm. knowing that if you do the work. If you have folks that are engaged, that have rolled their, their sleeves up mm -hmm. and are, are, are involved in something good, mm -hmm. the idea that someone else has an idea that maybe they haven't seen on the episodes mm -hmm. and they say, I want to be there. I want to be a part of that. I want the world to know what I'm doing to make a difference right here in the state or the community that they might love. Right. So that's the first thing I thought about. There's so much. We had these episodes, but there's so much more work oh that's going on. Gosh. And there's great work that we share, but yeah. there's so much more that's going it, on. It, you know, it ended up just like the, the individual program that's in Impact 365 mm -hmm, that, mm -hmm. that we've talked about that I've learned so much from. And then some people, they saw the postings on their social media, and they were excited about it. I saw it. Yeah, I saw it through right. my feed, which and is what good. Did, what did you think? I, I was very eager to find out more information about it. Well, first off, I saw Tierra. Right. I love Tierra. Um, but then I saw the Impact 3, um, 365 logo, and I thought that was already mm -hmm. captivating. I was like, okay, what is this all about? So I started to obviously look into it more and more. But that was my first impression, just from scrolling on social media. So I'm hoping that others who don't know what Impact 365 or maybe need to find out a little bit more information about United Way of Delaware will click the link and continue to follow and educate. So you, I'm happy that we're able to provide a platform for United Way of Delaware to get that get that information out there. So so and, and United Way of Delaware is here to help the community mm -hmm. on many, many levels. And I can't wait till you at home get to see tonight at 6 p.m. on DETV statewide and on all, all social media channels, DETV's mm -hmm. Facebook, our Twitter, United Way's Facebook, their Twitter as um their their YouTube as well. I'm super excited about this program. But uh, real quick, let's take a quick break and we'll be right back with some more questions with these two amazing people. How did the ETV start and how did you get here? DTV started approximately 10 years ago in the basement of my home. I had an idea to show people of color doing great things, but what happened was I got to the point that I said, I'm gonna just show people all together doing great things. The motto and the, the, the moral was to bring people together instead of using media to rip people apart and doing that you know, I just did a lot of hard work, a lot of free stuff, a lot of things of just showing people being themselves. I figured that media, and I saw that media wasn't doing that, so I just decided just to give it a shot, not knowing that it would bring me to where I am today. I had a, a great, great journey doing it. Met some amazing people, did some amazing things, worked on some amazing projects. You know, and with the, just a lot of hard work and a bunch of sacrifice, I'm here today. I done worked on everyone's campaign in the state of Delaware. And now, you know, I'm just doing what I do and doing it with friends. My biggest accomplishment right now would have to be, it would have to be this, hands down, without a doubt. We want to make sure that we inform the community wholeheartedly. So again, they can, they can have all the information that they need. For more information, you can find us at detvch.com. You can find us on YouTube. You can find us on Twitter and Facebook under DETV. Be sure to check us out. Tell me what you think. I really love the audience, Ivan. This is awesome. <laughs> Wow, I, I have to say, I really do love the live audience. The energy in the room is just so fulfilling. We need to make this a regular thing. I'm, I hear you, so <laughs> All right, so continuing the conversation with Rick Detweiler and Michelle Teller from United Way of Delaware. Again, thank you so much for taking time out of your very, very busy schedules because we all know how mm -hmm. busy you are all the time. 365 days of the year, <laughs> really, we do. But just to kind of go back into talking about Impact 365, let's talk about when does it air and how can people tune in? Where can they go exactly? A great mm -hmm. question. So mm -hmm. it starts tonight mm -hmm. at 6 p.m. Okay. And they can watch it on the DETV, Facebook, they can do your website, 
Twitter. Mm -hmm. um, they can also watch it at United Way of Delaware okay. um, website. We're going to have it right on the screen, easy for them to be able to get to, but it'll also be on our Facebook and our Twitter. We're going to make it easy to be able to push out for people to be able to watch it in a lot of different ways. Yeah. Michelle, and I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. I'm sorry, girl. Right now, right right I <laughs> <laughs> Michelle, I, I'm, I'm eager. What do, you, what do you think the takeaway will be? Oh, man. You know, as Rick was saying, I'm hopeful that people will be able to, one, be able mm -hmm. to realize that great things are really happening in mm -hmm. our community. Yes. Right? And two, hopefully they will hear a story that someone really will mm -hmm. feel that maybe didn't have hope. Mm -hmm. We'll have hope. Yeah. All right. And that someone will be inspired right. by mm -hmm. this, right? Like the, we don't want to just be able to give information and be given information. We want really the people right. to be able to hear what's happening and feel good that great things are really happening in our community. Yes. And with all the negative noise that goes on around us, it is a place to come to, mm -hmm. right? To be able to hear, um, look, we say this is our version of the truth. Right. <laughs> no, I got you. I got you. Mm -hmm. And it also may give folks a place just to know where to go. That relate that issue kind of I'm facing something like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So let me call the United Way or let me call that partner that was on that television screen and Impact 365 mm -hmm. and maybe they can help answer some of my questions or support me. And, and that's the great thing way. about about all the episodes, right? Every episode affects someone differently. Okay. Someone's going to be able to relate to someone that they've seen on air. And, 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 and I really am sitting here and I'm like, you guys made history like you mm -hmm. did because and, and but the most important get, uh, take back from us. From, and, and I'm gonna speak for the United Way and DETV is we really get to change someone's life, That's right? right? Someone on the other side of Delaware mm -hmm. of, of the, the canal is saying, I need help. They're mm -hmm. thinking, where can I get help? And they're probably have a little bit pride or maybe not have pride. They're not calling their neighbor. They're, they want to call someone and they might see this episode. And that's where communication, positive communication, and positive outreach really takes effect. And what we're doing combined as partners mm -hmm. to, to and, I, and I say that because partners make the world go that's around. Right. Right? That's right. That's right. And but partners can also change someone's life. So I am, I'm. It just hit me. Just hit me like, yo, we really changed someone's life again. And mm -hmm. that's the great part about not just being a nonprofit, mm -hmm. but being partners with you, you, you two at the United Way. Mm -hmm. And because I'm super excited for what you guys have done. Right. Yeah. And right. as you talk about strong partners, you talk about alignment, right? Mm -hmm. So we have this statewide operation that Michelle and the team, this phenomenal team mm -hmm. that we have doing work up and down the state. And now you guys have this platform mm -hmm. that's sharing the messages and sharing the great stories up and down the state, not portions of it, but across the entire state. Right. And that's where our work occurs also. So it's good to be partnering and aligned with you all. Rick, what are your hopes for the project? Oh, that folks will be inspired. That folks will see that this work is getting done, that lives are being changed, that there's real impact being made, measurable impact that's being made. And whether they're involved in the process of supporting others mm -hmm. or not, that folks will be inspired to find a way to help others, mm -hmm. find a way to lean into something that they may be passionate about mm -hmm. uh, in their community uh, and their specific neighborhood uh, with the hopes of making a difference. So to inspire others. My now, now yes. I'm gonna ask you a question, just straight personal, no United Way, no Rick that wallet, no, 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 no Michelle tell just just Michelle Teller, just Rick that wallet. I am fascinated. And when I created DETV, it was I, it was always about the why, right? Mm -hmm. Outside of everything else, why do you do what you do? And why do you do what you do? We'll start with Michelle. Yeah, great. So great question. So we are everything starts with the why, right? Really out of everything I do is because there's an, I see a need for people. Too many children. I have a personal passion too around literacy. I think too many kids can't read on grade level. Too many of our kids are unprepared to be tomorrow's workforce. Too many families are just struggling, right? That's my why, right? Every day is I get to work with amazing people and partners that get to be able to change them. Sometimes not at the scale we want to, but one by one. Right, right. Yeah, and very similar people. People. Mine specifically is about younger people. While I love my, you know, middle-aged, successful people, those that are leaning in. <laughs> See how you're doing. <laughs> you, middle-aged folks doing some things. But for me, it's always been young people. Yeah. Uh, recognizing that they have uh, uh, issues, challenges, this thing we call the opportunity gap that they face, mm. and we need to offer help mm. to them to help guide them through that uh, and navigate that issue that they face. That again, the 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 unequal access to opportunity. We've got to try and equalize that. So so we talk about, okay, opportunity gap, right? And then we talk about as a nonprofit of how do you fix that problem? And the solution is 
Impact 365. Like there you that. go. All right, like that's that. it. All right. I got it right this time. <laughs> All right, Impact 365. We're going to take a quick commercial break and we'll be right back with uh, Tierra Fair, right? That's right. All right, we'll be right back. <laughs> DETV has been Delaware's premium provider of creative digital and broadcasting solutions that bridges communities and connects people. We create great stories for all audiences. We deliver independent news throughout Delaware. We are digital platform innovators. And we develop marketing and sales solutions so you can stay connected to your audience. Now, why do we do what we do here on DETV? We do it because we care. So keep watching and follow us on all of our social media platforms. Remember, DETV, online, on air, on time. Every issue that you care about. Every issue that I care about. And every issue that affects our daily lives is impacted by one simple action. A, a vote. vote. As the Delaware Voting Rights Coalition, we stand ready to protect and expand access to voting. Because our communities deserve a democracy that works for all of us. Learn more and join us at aclu-de.org forward slash D V R C. Government doesn't make a move without an agenda, some type of plan. The problem is we haven't been on the agenda. Sometimes we're overlooked. Sometimes our interests aren't the interests of those in power. I'm your host, Kerwin Gaines, on DETV's new show, The Agenda. We're going to do our best to ensure that you, Delawareans, are knowledgeable about what's going on in the assembly. Federal government, local government, it doesn't matter. We're gonna do our best to ensure that folks that make the agenda on a daily basis have to answer for it. Let them explain what they're doing. If it affects you, it's on the agenda. Good morning, welcome back, and good morning, Wilmington. I'm Tierra Fair. I'm so excited to be here today and be the co-host for today's show. I am extra excited because today, for the first time, I have all of my co-hosts from Impact 365. This is literally my team that helps make Impact 365 possible. And I can't say thank you enough. There's a large team. This was a big labor of love by so many people but this is some of the people that were actually hosts on the show. I have with me Donna Snyder-White, Clarence Ray Parker, and Wanda Barrett. And thank you all so much for being here. Thank you. How's it be? So we get to have fun today. We This is like a little bit more casual than our Impact 365. I think that was the first time we were on camera together and we were very, everyone was like very nervous. <laughs> what questions are you going to ask exactly? Um, today is really about how much, we were, we're talking about how much fun we're having and we're trying to get people to make sure that they're watching tonight at six o'clock and every Monday after that. Absolutely. <laughs> Um, so, but first, tell everyone a little bit about you, what you do for United Way, and why you were so excited to be a part of the show. So, uh, thank you, Tiara. It's always great to be back here with you again, and you always make us feel so comfortable. <laughs> so, this was real easy for me to be here today to support the Impact 365 and you. Mm -hmm. So, um, my name is Donna Snyder White. Like you said, I am the Vice President of Financial Empowerment here at United Way of Delaware, and basically that means I get the work with a great group of people who really care about the community and try to help the community be more empowered and take care of their own uh, goals mm -hmm. and just work together as a group to uh, just be a part of the community. So I really appreciate it being here. That's awesome. That's awesome. And me, I'm uh, Clarence Ray Parker. Um, I'm a small business coach with the Minority Small Business Program. And uh, for me personally, uh, I just love the work I do. Um, I love entrepreneurship and that being the economic backbone in our community and knowing the importance of it and being able to be a part of the change that we really want to see across uh, the state and hopefully across the country. So. I have a million dollar question for you. Do so you right. have a favorite minority small business? 
<laughs> actually, that is a million dollar question. <laughs> um, actually, I don't. I actually love them all. Um, and I think the beauty of my work is that I get to, <laughs> yeah, the, uh, the beauty of it is that I get to work with a bunch of different businesses and me being a person that's interested in a lot of things that kind of caters to that because I can never, you know, have one simple formula, right? You got to be able to adjust on the fly. So that's the beauty of it. Absolutely. My name is Wanda Barrett. I am the community director of community engagement and relationship. Mm -hmm. Y para mí es un placer poder atender la comunidad hispana mm -hmm. en Delaware. Mi posición es asegurarme de que seamos recursos y que yo pueda traerle información y dirigir a las personas lo más posible en español. So my role in the United Way is the leader of all the Hispanic team or whatever is related to the Hispanic community, mm -hmm. bring resources and information that we could listen to their need and also assist them in one way or the other. I don't know if you guys peep that, but that was really cool, right? You see how she went in and out of Spanish really quickly. You see how we just kept not. <laughs> That's what you have to look forward to, though, in a Hispanic show. We have a show that is completely bilingual. So, and and, and it's beautiful because the show is um, mostly Spanish. -y. Like, it's mostly Spanish. But then they add some English in there every now and again. And, and, and I think that that is so beautiful because it shows the Hispanic people. So, thank you so much, thank Wanda. You, thank, thank you, thank you, thank you. Absolutely. So... As we are, um, we're talking today. What did? What was your favorite part of Impact Three Sixty Five? Do you have a, a part that you were really excited about? Because each of you had your own core co-hosts of your own show. So, was there a favorite part you had of your show? I think uh, Michelle and Rick said it the best. It's all about the people and the connection, mm -hmm. right? So, no organization can do anything by themselves. Mm -hmm. We really have to connect with partners to make a purpose and the purpose is to connect with people to help them out of any situation they they happen to find themselves being challenged by right mm -hmm. so the people the partnership and the purpose ties it together for me uh, personally uh, i have to have a connection with the work i do uh, i work i said work with great people uh, in the community but also my colleagues that are here today it really just ties everything together. And so the purpose, uh, the people, and then just the passion of everybody uh, around 365 just does it for me. Awesome. So is there a favorite part? Remember your show? Um, hey, yeah. your, your whole show was that's like, was one of my favorites. And it was when I, that was the first one. So yep. everyone was, everyone, <laughs> everyone yep. there was super nervous. We didn't know how it was gonna work and it worked beautifully. Do you have mm -hmm. a favorite part? Yeah. Um, being on camera, number one, right? But just, <laughs> right, it's always you fun. Um, close up yeah, you were ready for a close-up? Yeah, I was ready for makeup. I think they skipped me on that part. I'll circle no. back on it. <laughs> um, no, um, I just love seeing, you know, in the many ways that we serve, right, and uh, the many things that we do in the community, it's not one need that you can meet, right? It's just a big amalgamation of just different things and services that everybody do and I just love that aspect of it and then just to be able to be a part of the conversation and be on the forefront to let people know how we're serving and what you can do to get in touch I think that was just the the highlight of the day for me so thank you what about you Wanda para mí la la parte más importante y excitante fue el poder escuchar una familia testificar de su jornada aquí a Delaware me abrió los ojos a las necesidades que hay en la comunidad. So for me, Kara, it was very impactful in my life to hear the testimonial of the family bought, that we bought in, their journey to get to Delaware, and it opened to more resource, you know, that we can provide to families in the Hispanic community as well, you know, when we heard these testimonials. It was very impactful to my life. It was that, and the, what was amazing here again. Once again, we were we were in the back, and during that episode, we weren't able to we we couldn't communicate with everyone because we didn't we were not fluent. So uh, the family was telling their story about how they came from Delaware, and the check was long. It was hard, and it was just a very difficult. And uh, us being able to hear that and understand what happened and understand how they were able to get help. That's the be yes, beautiful yes, thing about it, right? And yes. I think that's the, that's the thing. Um, when people share their story, they're really sharing their personal perspective of their journey to wherever it is, right? Mm -hmm. So uh, I know during our episode, we had the Salvation Army here and they were talking about how they help so many different people. Mm -hmm. But they do that through partnerships as well. And they really do reach out to folks to make that connection every family has a story to tell not every family needs help 
-hmm. But those that do need to know that United Way is here, the partners are here, uh, and there's no judgment. I always like to say we have a judgment-free zone. We truly are a judgment-free zone to uh, help you uh, get to where you need to go. And, and so even with our Minority Small Business Program, you know, this is a partnership for sure because, you know, uh, with a business that you birth literally like a child, <laughs> yeah. you don't want anybody just kind of getting in your business, right? Mm -hmm. But but together they build that trust. The coaches build trust. Wanda builds trust. She brings the trusting relationships and that opens up people up like a flower. When you're there not judging and you're there to, to only support their interests, it gives me chills just thinking about it because mm -hmm. everybody seems to want something from somebody for some reason. These individuals really do it for the purpose, sole purpose of helping that other person thrive, right? And there's nothing more beautiful than that. I mean, that's what we should be about is partnering and help people grow. Absolutely. I love, I love, love, love that. I love everything you say. And yes, it is exciting. That's exciting. Yeah, yeah. And I think that's why with the, what's so beautiful about the show is that it kind of captured that. Yes, it captured yes, that absolutely. excitement. Exactly. It captured the stories. Yeah, exactly. But then more than anything, it told people that you can get help too. And so that's even the people that are watching right now. If you need help, you, there is help out there, whether it's calling 211 or one on one financial coaching for everyone in Delaware, and it's yes, free. Yes, yes, yes. And it's and we use so many partners to help deliver that service, which is so amazing. So all across the state, and so all of those things, minority small business support, like all of those things are su such a beautiful thing. I, I just want to really, really thank you all. And as we're wrapping up, I just want to have one last question. What is we we're talking about our whys today? So what is your why? What is your why and why should people be watching Impact 365? Uh, for me, my why is to make a difference, mm -hmm. right? And to serve. And um, just real fast in the hallway on the way in, I had a wholesome interaction with somebody um, who was looking for help within his business and didn't know who to talk to. He was trying to find an SBA. And I just bumped into him in the hallway. He asked me two questions and I was able to give him my card to try to get into this program and get him the help he needs. That's what it's all about, right? You find somebody and any walk of life that you can help just to be able to serve in that way. That's beautiful. El por qué deberían de ver el programa para mí es que, que estamos incluidos. United Way nos incluyó en todo el proyecto y no estamos solos. United Way está ahí para darnos los recursos necesarios. My why they should watch the show and I encourage them is because United Way embraced the Hispanic community. We're there, we're there inclusive. You know, we are there included. We're no longer alone. We are part of United Way, and here it is. Yep, and for me, I've already said it. It's, it's about people and passion. And we've got a great colleague and co-host of Impact 365 who makes you feel comfortable from the moment you hit the set. Mm -hmm. So I thank you for making us feel comfortable, and thank you for elevating the voice of United Way, and just thank you for being the beautiful person you are. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for thank sharing you. your story. Yeah. I really, really appreciate it, and we all really, really appreciate it. We are going to be right back. We're going to check out some outtakes slash bloopers. I hope nothing crazy happens with me. <laughs> I don't remember what I said. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Your camera is this one? going straight ahead. Okay. All right. Awesome. Camera speed. <laughs> Have fun. Three, two, one. Action. You can see your banter. Let me just hear how you want to go into introducing Mark. Um. Can I do it just one more time? One more time? One more time? Yes, please. I messed up. I can I see? Okay, that wraps up. We'll look at how we're helping children in. Thank you. Times to go. Times to go. I'm hungry. Who's gonna feed me? Nobody. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Tierra. Hi, everyone. My name is Ray Parker. I'm a business coach under the Minority Small Business Program with the United Way of Delaware and Barclays. Uh, but enough about me. I'm going to introduce a video. Excuse me. We're going to say we're going to watch a short video introducing our next segment. Loosen up, Ray. All right, my man. All right. Got this, Kelly. 
<laughs> yeah, Mikey, you out here? Come on, I'm trying to go home. I'm trying to get out of this dress. Come on. All right, in five, four, three. Have a good show. Woo! All right. <laughs> we didn't have R&B music this time. I think that's really killed the mood. The was yeah, because you didn't have the, our 90s music to help Somebody us, play like, keep, to help us <laughs> keep, it helped me keep my strength up for the job. <laughs> you, like, you really have to do better with that next time. You okay? know what? Oh You're my absolutely goodness. right. <laughs> <laughs> You're absolutely right. We're going to get you pumping real quick. Oh, my gosh. As soon as it's been there, it's up. What? <laughs> <laughs> we couldn't pay for our... <laughs> no, we couldn't pay for our... Pay for our music. <laughs> All right, ready? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I wish it was my birthday. <laughs> All right, all right, all right, all right. Well, welcome back, everyone. So we have Miss Aguilar, Amidis Aguilar, went from client to coach. Welcome, Amidis. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Now, now, what was it like for you going from client and you know, and 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 and, um, and learning about all the benefits that Impact mm -hmm. Three Sixty Five had to now going to coach back to the LACC? Well, um, when I was a client, um, it was for me very frustrating to know about my finance, right? <clears throat> Sitting and see my credit for the first time in years, mm -hmm. and uh, wish it was a scary thing. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> and then my coach say, "Not that bad." I'm like, "For okay. you, right?" right. Uh, but then actually, it wasn't that bad, and I was able to fix it. Uh, I pushed it in my home. I got my car, my finance in order, and uh, one day when I was home, um, my first home, open that door, get that nice sleep, and I tell my husband, "Do you hear that?" And then he said, "What? What are you talking about?" I hear nothing, I'm like, exactly. Yes. We don't have anybody wow. making noises mm -hmm. on the second floor, so we're <laughs> home. And I, I'm like, okay, I wanna do this for people too. Right. I wanna give that feeling of, yes, it is possible. It doesn't matter where you come from. I'm Latina, I'm from Puerto Rico, but I did it and, and people can do it too. And I'm like, let me, let me, when the opportunity came, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do this. Right. I'm gonna bring people mm -hmm. to that excitement. No, I'm sorry. Are there other the community are they listening to you? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have a lot of clients with a lot of mm. success, uh, pushing in their home, getting their first credit card that they never thought they're gonna have a credit card. Wow. Because mm -hmm. also as a Latino, sometimes we are afraid of banks and things mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. uh, but people, are, I've been learning like it's okay to have your money in the bank. It is secure. Mm -hmm. You're gonna be able to buy a house. You know, through this program uh, with the United States Stand By Me, we encourage you to do it. It is free. Why yeah. not to take an advantage right. of that? Okay. Uh, and that's what I think it is the people. We are over 30 coaches around old Delaware. So we have a little bit of seasoning everywhere for everybody. Right. At, at what moment did you feel that you were inspired to become a coach? Um, when I go my home, when okay. I go my home, um, as I mentioned, I didn't th thought that was something that was going to be possible for me because mm -hmm. when I was growing up, my parents struggled a lot with mm -hmm. that. And I'm like, oh my God, this is going to be very difficult. Mm -hmm. But you know, my coach make it very easy for me to understand and go me through that. And that's when I'm like, okay, uh -huh, I'm going to get people their homes. I'm going to get the people <laughs> their credit fix. Let's okay. do this. Now, because now, who are you? Now, let's talk about Wanda. Right? <laughs> let's talk about Wanda. How was she uh, working with that daily, uh, working with that um, Impact 365? Um, this is um, my first time um, here, and, uh, and I'm like, okay, um, I'm going to be in this program that it is trying to show people that, yes, you can do this. Mm -hmm. United Way have this program that give you the tools to do it, and it won't cost you nothing. I'm like, of course I'm going to be in that. I know I'm making an impact. That's right. <laughs> That's right. That's right. And I know um, I'm very grateful for this program. Uh, Stand by me. Um, have trained me, have shown me that things are possible. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter of anything, your age. It doesn't matter your culture. It doesn't matter anything. It just, here are the tools. So let's go do it. And you don't have to do it alone. Maris, thank you so much for that. Yeah. Because I feel like our viewers that are listening need to hear that and need to hear that story. Mm -hmm. Because you, again, you never know who you're inspiring, who is listening, and maybe needs to hear that. So thank you for being honest with us. Thank you. 
and doing what you're doing. Who do you want to inspire through it all? Anybody that is struggling, anybody that is here uh, for one reason or another, one from this country, people from other countries, my Latino community, hey. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I want people to know that uh, it is possible. You know, if you have a goal in mind and you had the desire to do it, we're here to support you. You don't have to do it alone. We will hold your hand. And I'm going to be with you when you have that keys from your home. <laughs> wow. I'm so, you give her a round of applause. Again, <laughs> Come on. Thank you. We, we really get to sit here and, and hear someone's life change mm -hmm. from an idea that someone had. And if that is not inspiring and encouraging, I think you might need to check your pulse. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. these, are, these are lives. And she said, you know, people are getting their, their credit card for the first time. Some of us got our credit cards when we was like 17 and 18. Mm -hmm. But these are people, they, we are, there are people out here that are really looking and yes. really getting their life changed from an mm -hmm. idea and a program that the United Way is having. So again, for the United Way, in fact, 65. And, and, and for you, and for you, most definitely. All right, so um, when you have your barbecue, we all are invited, right? <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay. Okay. All right, cool. All right, um, I, what, what you got over there, Vin? I'm speechless now. Oh, I, no, I'm, it's okay. Yeah. I, lo I love when you go off script. It's I think it's more authentic, right? Yeah. Don't you agree? It's more authentic, really connect with our viewers. Plus, it shows that we're real. And this is a realistic show, and these are realistic people, and that we want to connect with our viewers and really help inspire and educate. Mm -hmm. But we need individuals like you and Tiara and Michelle and Rick and everybody that's coming in, Donna, Ray, and, and Clarence, and um, and what was it? That's the Wanda. Whole world. Yeah, every, everybody. <laughs> but we need everyone to come together to really make an impact. Yeah. And that's why we're here talking about again Impact 365. So, are there any upper, any other opportunities that you offer that we haven't touched on that you may want to mention? I will say um, the opportunity that um, Stand By Me offers, since that's the program that I work with, and uh, United Way is mm -hmm. empower people. You know, right. like give the people the resources they need mm -hmm. to become what they want to be. Mm -hmm. If they want to have a home, if they want to pursuit and education, whatever it is they want to do, you know, uh, there is a hope. Mm -hmm. There is something you can grab and say, here we go. I'm not going to do it alone. This person is going to cheer me up and I'm going to be fine. I'm going to fulfill what I want. Love it. Love right. it. Love it. That's All right. right. I think right. that, I think that's it. Thank you so much. Are we, are we going to the Yes. Round? Yes. Give we'll a round of break. applause. Round of applause. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're actually going to toss it to Tierra. So okay. Tierra's not done yet with us. She needs to come back on the show more often. Well, Tierra, I really love I'm, her I'm, energy. I'll tell you what. <laughs> I, I think I, and I, I got a crazy idea that I think um, that United Way might have to have their own mm -hmm. little show here on DETV. But we'll talk about that later. Yes. Hosted by Tierra. Um, great things again at United mm -hmm. Way. If you need help within your finances, early early childhood education, um, contact the United Way. Uh, I think it's unitedwayde.org. No. U W U W D E dot org. All right. They're like, no, Ivan. No, no, no. Bad. That's all right. That's all right. No. But I'm sure, I'm sure you can just Google United Way of Delaware and it'll pop up right away. I'm sure you're able to find Stand By Me, Impact 365, because United Delaware is they're just ahead. They're right. two steps ahead of everyone. So they're very ready for you to look up find out information, look up all the resources that they offer because it really will make an impact. And you know what we need to do? And I think we need to take this time, 30 seconds. Would you mind inviting the, the our Latino brothers and sisters to Impact 365 in Spanish? Of course. All right, this is your camera. Where's your camera? That camera right there. Hola a todos. Les invito a que vean Impacto 365 para que se empoderen y aprendan un poquito de qué está haciendo United Way. Así que, venga. Veanos. Yes. Gracias. <laughs> Thank you. I was going to do it. I was going to do it in Spanish, but <laughs> see the way my, my language is my, my, mm -hmm. yeah, set up. But anyhow, we're going to toss it. Leave it to the professional. Right? Right? We're going to toss it over to Tierra on the couch. Tierra, what's happening over there? I have the extreme pleasure of really just. <laughs> 
to actually talk to one of the people in the audience because we've been telling the audience to shush the whole time. We're like, clap, shush. Duh. Like, we're giving them all these roles. So I get to actually talk to you all. And I'm so happy. Please tell us all about who you are and tell the audience who you are. Sure. I'm Matt Parks, and I work for Discover Bank, and it's great to be here. Hey, Ivan, uh, Al Roker has nothing on you, Ivan. You, you, uh, you, you, you certainly, uh, being here in the studio watching today has been a lot of fun, and uh, it's great to be able to participate in something to, to talk about our own hometown and all the great things that are happening. Matt, we Lunch on you. <laughs> Bardea State. Matt, we just have a one que I have one question for you. It's a simple question, but it could what does community, what does the word community mean to you? Sure. So community to me is a safe place where you can live, work, and worship. Um, basically a place where people look out for one another, support each other, and, and generally care about our, uh, each other. So, you know, hopefully, uh, you know, folks, uh, you know, can, 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 can act in the community and, uh, and, and look out for one another and believe in one another and, and, uh, and work for each other. I love that because community is one of the words that Impact 365 is all about. It's about our community. And I love exactly to work, play, and worship all together and, and really make a difference in a positive way. Thank you so, so much for being here. This is one of our many esteemed guests today. We have some beautiful, beautiful guests. Go ahead and clap it up so we, we know y'all are here. And... I am just so, so excited to have them. We are going to go back to Vincenza and Ivan with Marcus Watkins. All right, thank you so much, Tierra. All right, last up on the plaza this morning, we have Marcus Watkins, Manager of Digital Marketing Engagement for United Way here on the plaza. Marcus, what's happening, my man? How are you doing, my friend? Well, I'm good, brother. We <laughs> yeah. go way back, man. I'm talking way about uh, like eighth grade. Like way, way back. Way, way back. Marcus and I go and, way and back, too. What? what, what right? You, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, I think college, UD, yeah, University yeah. of Delaware. And who don't you know in this room, Vincenzo? All right. <laughs> Delaware. <Everybody. for> <laughs> and, and what's the question you ask everybody in Delaware? What, what high, high school did you go, go to? to? <laughs> right. 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 But um, Marcus, thanks. Thanks for coming, man. Um, right. What was what was it like working on Impact 365? It was so exciting. The, uh, the environment here at BETV is electrifying for anyone who's into marketing Thank and you. video. And this was the first time I got to really get a behind the scenes look at how a television show is produced. Yeah. Did you have fun? I had too much <laughs> fun. A lot of fun. And uh, I got to do some uh, post production as well. Mm -hmm. So I really got to hear these stories again and again and again and the right. intricacies of them and it, it never gets old. Yeah. And hearing these stories and being involved in the sausage making, right? Yeah. Like, did your life change? Did these stories inspire you in any way? Well, I'm always inspired every day. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I've been with United Way for a good bit now. And um, when we were in office, I would hear the stories of people who were calling Delaware 211 for that immediate help. Mm -hmm. So it's almost impossible mm -hmm. not to be inspired when you're around you know, colleagues that care so much and people that need that help and receive that help. Let's talk, I'm sorry, Ben, I That's took over okay. the whole damn I know. Thing. <laughs> It's okay, it's okay. I know there's lots of information and we're always very eager to make sure we get that information out to right. our viewers that are listening because it is important. Right. And I think it's very, very imperative. So yeah. I do have a question for Marcus. You okay. don't mind that I... No, okay. I don't mind double dutch. Go ahead, jump on in, girl. <laughs> All right, so Marcus, I do have a question for you. We did touch on it a little bit. We did mention about your role at United Way of Delaware, mm -hmm. but could you just kind of go into detail of what you do? Yeah, my mm -hmm. role at United Way of Delaware is to help tell this story. Mm -hmm. We want to connect the story to data, and we want to use data to back the story. So we're always looking for ways to expand our network to really get people to donate, volunteer, even advocate for United Way and our partners. So that's my job, to come up with innovative ideas and ways to broaden our reach. Right. Well, they have the perfect person. Yeah. Good job. Yeah, he killed it. He, he, he's really, they do. Well, you. Knowing you, you're very innovative thank you. and creative. Yes, thank so you. They, do, they do have the perfect person yeah, they for the job. And United Way gives me a platform to innovate in a way that it really changes people's lives. So right. it's one thing to market a product <laughs> that you know might make people feel good or might make people happy, but it's another thing to be marketing products that really change people's lives lives that's totally right. different right that's Whole totally different, different. Mm -hmm. um, stakes are way high yeah yes. stakes are different and way high mm -hmm. you said 411 let's touch a little bit about 211 let's start let's touch a little bit about 211 what it and what it is okay delaware 211 is a helpline where people can call and get connected to the resources they need to thrive again mm -hmm. and they can go to delaware211.org and get that same help so you're going to get a trained uh referral specialist who's connected with all the different organizations in Delaware, and they're gonna connect you 
not only with the help you need, but they're going to follow up to make sure you got the help you need. Well, so when we when we're thinking two one one, when we're thinking United Way, we're thinking a haven that people, regardless of crossing the line, would you need help with? You can call two one one, and United Way will get you plugged in to the or, the, the 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 group that you need. Mental health services, mm. uh, food emergencies, wow. anyone who natural disasters right. after a hurricane comes, anyone who's experiencing a crisis in Delaware can dial Delaware 211. That's what I'm talking about. Right, right. Yeah, right. yeah. easy. So just, easy. That's, that's the easy button. <laughs> well, it's helpful and resourceful. Yeah. So just to go back to Impact 365, what mm. was the, um, the ep what, what episode that you felt like was the most important or impactful that you can touch on? Well, I think they're all impactful in their own way. Mm -hmm. Me personally, I thought it was interesting to see all the different entrepreneurs tell their experience, as well as the, um, the episode mm -hmm. that featured the family that came to Delaware and their journey of getting here. So people, uh, when you tune in tonight at 6 p.m., <laughs> hey. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised at the way the stories of our partners and the people we help came across. Yeah, yeah, I love it, I love it. Yeah, all right. Um, about inspiring. Brother, Market Tech. Yes. I'm gonna call you Market Tech. Oh, I, know yeah. Market Tech. I know him as that too. Uh, everyone knows him as Market Tech. <laughs> they know him in China as Market Tech. But, um, again, thank you so much for what you do thank and you. everything that you do at the United Way, and but most yeah. of all for for the community. Man. Thank you. Know. Thanks for having us. All right, all right, Tierra, what's happening? What you got over there? Now, so I uh, again have the pleasure of speaking to one of our studio audience guests. You want to tell the people who you are? Greetings to you, Tara, and uh, this is an outstanding show. First and foremost, Tyrone Jones of the Bloom Energy. Awesome! Thank you, thank you so much for being here, Ty. Again, I have one question. It might be a hard question. I don't know. I don't know if you've been practicing. <laughs> All right, so the question is, when you think of Impact 365, what are the words, what are the things that come to mind? Well, and how much time do I have? Well, 30 seconds or less. Okay, 30 seconds or less. <laughs> well, let's just look at the word. Impact is the end of all the work that had been done over the course of 365 days. And it's not just in one individual doing, it's a collective. Um, group of organizations and people coming together to impact somebody's life and to change the community as a whole. So to me, what you're doing today is just highlighting the end, but also you're highlighting the journey to get to the end. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate you being here with us today. I really appreciate everyone being here with us today. There are so many partners here and I'm scared to start naming names because I'm going to forget someone and they're gonna be angry with me. But I have to give a shout out to LACC because they're in here pretty, there's a lot of them in here. So we're really excited about LACC. We're really excited about all, like really all our partners. We have Laz Esperanza who's here. We have so many great people who are just, about all about impact and all about coming together and convening and making a difference. So it's not just a United Way show, it's about the everyone show. And that's why I really encourage everyone to watch Impact 365. It starts tonight at 6 p.m on channel 28 but you can watch it in many different ways if you don't have a channel 28 but you're watching now so you probably do but if you don't have channel 28 and you're watching us on facebook you can watch it right on facebook you can watch it on united way of delaware's facebook page you can watch it on DETV's facebook page you can watch it on both of our youtube channels and you can watch it on both of our twitter channels and then if you like run out of places and you can't remember, just go to uwde.org and we will have it streaming live on our website. We are so excited. There are no excuses for, for why you do not watch this show because if you don't remember at 6 p.m., it's okay because it will be on right after. And so I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. This was such a labor of love and it wouldn't have been done without so many amazing, amazing people. Make sure to watch Impact 365 tonight at 6 p.m. and every Monday thereafter. I am going to kick it back to Vincenza and Ivan. Thank you so much for having us. You're natural. Appreciate you, Tierra. <laughs> Ty, I'm gonna need you to stay on our next episode. All right. Right. Um, She's so good at that. No, I'm talking about Ty. Tierra, oh. Tierra, Tierra. No, you know, I'm sorry to let Tierra go. I, I, I love Tierra, <laughs> so we can have her on the show. Tierra, you're always welcome here at DTV. A good morning, Wilmington. But again, another great show. Another great show. United Way of Delaware, Impact 365. Tonight, 6 p.m. Mm -hmm. on everything from right. uh, Channel 28 Comcast. Mm -hmm. And like Tierra said, 
um, uh, Facebook, YouTube, mm -hmm. United Way's page, our page. You, you, if you miss it, check your pulse. All Something right. <laughs> well, we're going to do a quick shout out to all of our sponsors, Dart, Wi-Fi Services, Balanced Strength and Fitness. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in this beautiful Monday. Make sure you play the Powerball. 1.9 billion reasons we can make a difference, starting with United Way of Delaware Impact 365. She just gave Delaware Public Lottery a free... Uh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. We're going to make a difference. But before you play Powerball tonight, <laughs> watch Impact 365 here on DETV and United Way. Thank you so much. Remember to hug someone, love someone, feed someone, clothe someone, and most of all, make an impact. 365.